Hello. Today we are looking at how to install VROID Studio on a Chromebook. Please take note that you need a Chromebook with an Intel or AMD processor for this tutorial to work. Firstly we will enable Linux apps on our device. To do this we will go to our system settings and click on the Linux icon on the left panel. Now we will turn on the Linux apps. Now that we have enabled Linux apps on our system, we will continue to the next step and that is to download the Windows version of VROID. Open the package in your file manager. Rename the package to vroid.exe. Move it to your Linux folder. Now we will continue to the next part of the installation process, which is to run several commands in a terminal that will install Wine. Wine is an application that allows us to install some Windows applications on a Chromebook. All the commands are in the video description. Now we will copy the first command and open a terminal session from our app menu. Next, we will paste the command into our terminal, either with a two-finger click on your terminal or click Ctrl, Shift and V together. This command will enable 32-bit architecture for Wine on your system. This command should run automatically as soon as you paste it into a terminal session. Now we will download the Wine security key with the next command. Now we will add the security key to our system. Now we will be pasting the next two commands into our terminal. This will add the wine repositories to our system. Now we will add another security key that Wine requires. Now we will update our system repositories of our Linux apps.
Now we will install wine. Press enter to confirm the installation. Wine is now installed. Now we need to install three additional packages which wine requires. Click on install to confirm the installation. Click on install to confirm the installation. Click on install to confirm the installation. Now we will continue to the next step, and that is to install Vriet. We will install it, with the next command. Please follow the installation wizard, as seen in the video. As you can see VROID is installed. Now we will close the installer. We will find a VROID launcher in your menu now but it won't work. So, to launch it, run the last command every time in a Linux terminal, and everything will work as expected. However, we need to modify the command first. Firstly, we copy the name of our Linux apps. Then we replace it with username in the last command. Let's launch it now.
enjoy the Royd Studio.